Right, where should I put the mic? On the beanie? Absolutely not. Let's just do the classic on the shelf. Alright, so the other day, I made a video trying to speculate about how bread was invented. I talked about how oh, the first ever bread in the world was made by crushing up the roots of plants that lived in the water, and then they would mix that with flour and water into a dough, and then put that on a rock to cook a flatbread. However, I could not imagine how someone would just wake up in the morning and decide to do that. That sounds impossible, how do you get that idea? I started speculating, and the idea I came up with in the video was that a child was messing about with stuff, okay? They were messing about with plants, you know, fiddling with wheat, just brewing evil potions like a child loves to do. And then doing that, I guess they accidentally made the first dough and accidentally left it next to a fire. And I knew this was quite an implausible statement when I made the video, I just couldn't think of any other way that bread could possibly have been invented. Turns out there actually is a plausible way. You see, one of the viewers left a comment under the video saying there was a book which explained how bread and beer were apparently invented. It was called something like the history of the world in six b drinks. I googled it and sure enough, they have the answer. Turns out the first ever human use of wheat was probably to make soup or porridge. And I guess that somebody was just experimenting, trying to invent a new kind of soup and accidentally made the first ever dough. But as another commenter also pointed out, that still doesn't explain the creation of flour, okay? All the mixing stuff, you know, the, the boiling bubble, toil and trouble thing, all that can be explained by just humans naturally wanting to be creative, will naturally try and invent new things. But why on earth would somebody try to crush wheat into flour? In my mind, probably the most likely way this could happen is if somebody was bored and started fiddling them out with stuff, okay? He started maybe taking a rock and trying to beat some uh, wheat seeds with it, and suddenly he noticed that those wheat seeds were turning to white powder and thought, ah, oh, this is really satisfying. So he started picking up more and more pieces of wheat and started beating it with rock, and it's, ah, oh, this, this, this is lovely, I, I enjoy making white powder with this, and eventually he, uh, you know, tasted a bit of it, mm. oh, this is good. And then they probably decided to put it in food. I guess that's probably the most likely way it worked. But still, I stand by this. My favourite species, humans, my favourite food, bread. And the reason that bread is my favourite food, you can do absolutely anything with it, okay? Look, bagels, croissants, baguettes, loads of different kinds of bread, chapatis, naans, so many options, it's like the interchangeable multi-food. It's the Super Mario Maker of food, i.e. you can do whatever you want with it, okay? You can put any ingredient you like in it, it there's... There's so many options here! And despite the fact that bread is such a diverse kind of food, it still somehow always ends up being delicious, you know? H how?